More than anywhere, I'm probably here at my family gym. Um, if you didn't know, we own this, uh, my brothers and I, and it's all a team effort. It's tough and it can get draining. And family businesses are always hard, but this is something that our pops handed down to us. Um, and we have all kind of just know and agree that it's something that we want to keep. It's something that we hold to a high standard and we try our best to um, make it better and we try our best to keep it going. And um, gyms and dojos are really hard places to run, but it's something that I am most proud of and I'm proud of being raised in a gym and it's really important to me. It's really important that we keep it going. It's really important that we keep um, really our, the post's name in martial arts going. And I think that's why, you know, all of us, you know, are here trying to constantly make it better, trying to work hard and be here and uh, just keep it going. Just keep it going. As a martial artist, especially, uh, mind, body, and spirit is such a, bi a big aspect um, in my life. Before anything, uh, spirit has to be in line. Knowing yourself, being introspective, knowing what you truly want, knowing how to better oneself. Training has definitely um, become one of my escapes. Uh, training is something that I can always turn to and go, okay, here's my base. Let's go from here. This is what you're good at. Get better at this. Everything else is going to fall in line. There's a lot of days where I really don't want to. There are days where I have to kick my butt to get out of bed in the morning. You know, I try to wake up at 4.30 um, at least every morning just so I can get up, stretch, meditate, you know, read uh, something that's gonna feed my mind, watch something that's gonna feed my mind, listen to something that's gonna feed my mind. Um, and I don't always wanna do that. I really don't. And, and there are times where I feel like, uh, it, that's the last thing that I want to do. But for me, it's a matter of knowing my why, and that's how I push myself. Um, I feel like I've always been somebody who knows what she wants. Um, and whenever I think about my goals and who I want to become in the future and who I strive to become every day, um, a better version of me, that kind of takes me over and uh, reminds me, okay, it doesn't matter how you feel right now because this is what is going to get you to that next point. And usually when I get started, it, it, uh, it just kind of flows and I, I feel better and I start getting into it. Um, but I had to work up to that. that. That didn't always come naturally. I had to really firmly grasp my why um, and constantly feed it every day. Like I said, I do a lot of mindset training, um, reading, listening, watching to things that are gonna build my mindset. And I will 100% say that that is what pushes me um, on the days where my body um, really doesn't want to. Even my, whenever, you know, I think that I don't want to, I just have to switch that uh, on and off switch on 